Thank you for joining me for yet another unboxing video. And today we have another budget store find and a weird one. This time it's Osho Zen Taro. The transcendental game of Zen includes 79 cards plus an instruction book. The transcendental game of Zen. When life seems to be full of doubt and uncertainty, we tend to look for a source of inspiration. What will happen in the future? What about my health of the children? What will happen if I make this decision and not that one? This is how the traditional tarot is often used to satisfy a longing to know about the past and future. This Osho Zen tarot focuses instead on gaining an understanding of the here and now. It is a system based on the wisdom of Zen, a wisdom that says events in the outer world simply reflect our own thoughts and feelings, even though we ourselves might be unclear about what those thoughts and feelings are. So it helps us to turn our attention away from outside events so we can find a new clarity of understanding about what is happening in our own innermost hearts. The conditions and states of mind portrayed by the contemporary images on the cards are all shown as being essentially transitional and transformative. The text in the accompanying book helps to interpret and understand the images in that simple, straightforward, down-to-earth language of Zen. This is brought to you by St. Martin's Press. All right, base price is $22.95. All right, so let's crack this bad boy open and see what kind of goodness we have on the inside. So we got a book. Osho Zen Tara. Wow. Now you talk about a book, that is quite the book. The Zen attitude towards life is that of laughter, of living, of enjoying, of celebrating. Zen is not anti-life, it is life affirmative. It accepts that all that is. This very body, the Buddha, by St. Martin's Press. Now, this is a ginormous book, so we're not going to read through the whole thing. Right. But again here. Game of Zen. All right. So we got a table of contents. It was released in 1994 by Osho International Foundation. Okay. So we've got an introduction the Osho Zen Tara, how to play the trans transcendental game of Zen, major arcana, minor arcana, card spreads or layouts, glossary of symbols, Osho, the source of inspiration, about the illustrator, list of references, further information. So it talks about major arcana, the fool, existence, inner voice, creativity, the rebel, no think, nothingness, the lovers, awareness, courage, aloneness, change, breakthrough, new vision, transformation, integration, conditioning, thunderbolt, silence, past lives, innocence, beyond illusion, completion, and the master. Then you have your minor arcana, fire, mastery of action, king of fire, the creator, king, queen of fire, knight of fire, page of fire. Water, mastery of emotions, king of water, queen, knight, and page. So healing, receptivity, trust, understanding, up there you have the creator, sharing, intensity, playfulness, control, morality, morality, fighting in mind, which is king of clouds, clouds, mastery of the mind, rainbows, mastery of the physical, abundance, flowering, slowing down, and venture. Obviously, all of them are king, queen, knight, page. One's clouds, one's rainbows, one's fire, and one's water. All the elements. Again, uh, suit of fire, suit of water, suit of clouds, suit of rainbows. So lots and lots and lots of stuff here. During the course of play, commentary, the inner voice, creativity, the rebel, nothingness, awareness. And the book goes on and on to discuss each of the different cards that they have in the deck. It tells you a little bit about all the cards that are being used. Postponement, comparisons, guilt, and gives you a little background about it. So let's take a look at one of these. So here we have, so it says fire action, experiencing. It says, you just look around, look into the eyes of a child or into the eyes of your beloved, your mother, your friend, or just feel a tree. You have, have you ever hugged a tree? Hug a tree and one day you will come to know that is not only the, that you have hugged the tree, 
but that the tree also responds. The tree also hugs you. Then for the first time, you will be able to know what the tree is not just a form. It is not just a certain species the botanists talk about. It is an unknown God, so green in your courtyard, so full of flowers in your courtyard, so close to you, beckoning you, calling you again and again. Commentary. Each figure in this mandala holds the right hand up in an attitude of receiving and the left hand down in an attitude of giving. The whole circle creates a tremendous energy field that takes on the shape of the double dorje, the Tibetan symbol for the thunderbolt. The mandala has a quality like that of the energy field that forms around a Buddha, where all the individuals taking part in the circle make a unique contri contribution to create a unified and vital whole. It's like a flower whose wholeness is even more beautiful than the sum of its parts, at the same time enhancing the beauty of each individual petal. You have an opportunity to participate with others now to make your contribution to creating something greater and more beautiful than each of you could imagine alone. Your participation will not only nourish you, but will also contribute something precious to the whole. So there's that card there. And again, the book goes on and on about all these different kinds of cards that you have in here. So setting it up. And go here. So you have the diamond shape. You have the flying bird. The key. The mirror. The Celtic cross. Relating. The paradox. And glossary. Explaining everything. So there's your rule book. Your rule book. Huh, I think this is the, by far the, law, the largest rule book I have for any of the games that I've reviewed. So it comes in at a whopping 176 pages. But of course, you're going to need this tome to make sure that you understand everything that's being discussed or the cards that you're looking. So we're going to pop out the, again, the cards. The cards are beautifully illustrated. It's a really pretty fantastic deck that they have here. It appears that all the backs are identical or the fronts are identical, depending how you want to look at it. Let's see what kind of cards you get in this deck here. Ripeness. Beyond Illusion. Rebirth. Turning in. Letting go. Control. Celebration. Adventure. Clinging to the past. Guilt. Innocence. Silence. Patience. Compromise, the fool, understanding, past lives, again the illustrations are absolutely gorgeous, bright colors, awesome, comparison, totality, success, postponement, aloneness, guidance, breakthrough, Friendliness, ordinary, uh, ordinariness, isolation, suppression, change, the rebel, mind, conditioning, laziness, traveling, slowing down, healing, harmony, sorrow, the source, intensity, politics, courage, participation, thunderbolt, morality, fighting, possibilities, the dream, abundance, moment to moment, awareness, existence, consciousness, Playfulness, inner voice, trust, the creator, receptivity, exhaustion, the outsider, the miser, projections, we are the world, integration, experiencing, transformation, new vision, going with the flow, the burden, Maturity, nothingness, the lovers, 
flowering, the master, creativity, schizophrenia, stress, sharing, and completion. So these are all the cards that are included. And of course, all the instructions with reading the cards is right here in the rule book. So like I said today, was a rather different type of unboxing. Again, it's in, it has a huge instruction book, book, which has 176 pages in it, lots and lots of cards here, 79 to be precise. And this concludes our unboxing of Osho Zen Tarot, the transcendental game of Zen. As always, thank you so much for joining me for this unboxing video. It's truly appreciated. If you enjoyed it, you can always give us a thumbs up and leave a comment below. As always, you could always hit that subscribe button. This way you're kept, we will be kept up to date as to any time we release new content to the page. As always, thank you so much for joining us. Be safe, be well. Enjoy the remainder of your day. I'll catch you on the next unboxing video.